Tonight, a call to action against gun violence. The mayor and other Columbus City leaders gathered earlier today calling on state legislatures to pass common sense gun laws. That message was carried on into the evening by mothers of murdered Columbus children. New at 11, 10 TV's Richard Solomon was at a ceremony for mothers who honor their lost children. This is the side of violence that many don't see, right? It's the pain, the tears. Along this bridge are hundreds of lots. And the sad thing is tonight, they added nearly 20 more. This is for Deshaun. This is for Deshaun. Every name that's read. This is for William. Is a person that was taken from every one of them. And this crowd is someone who lost a loved one to violence. Heartache, pain. Um, some days I can be good, some, yeah, some days it's bad. Anita Akins lost her son, Carlos Hardman Jr., in March of 2012. He died in a drive-by, and his murder is still unsolved. His sister, Leah Baker, was with him that night. 19 years, he couldn't even make it out of scenes, but I try to keep him with me and have him feel his strength to me, to keep me going, but it's hard. Every day moving forward is a challenge, a painful reminder, and that's what brings her and so many others alike here. Locked and loaded. Locked and loaded to the Rich Street Bridge for the Lock of Love ceremony. It's something mothers or murdered Columbus children do, unfortunately, often. It's a chance for parents and caretakers to honor their loved ones. The sad truth is a lot of the victims were taken by gun violence. It's just people that just lack the basic common sense of having one. And we just got, it's basically these young kids. It's the young kids that's carrying them and thinking it's cool. The same plea was called for earlier in the day by the mayor, city, and state leaders. It makes a difference for even one Columbus family. It's worth giving this fight everything we've got. Because the reality is when you drive past this bridge, there are too many locks on it. They want you to see this, their tears, their reality, in hopes the message will click with somebody someday. And this is the effect that will happen if they keep doing the things that they're doing. So. Just and those with Mothers of Murder Columbus children say every single lock that is on this bridge, every single lock that they will add to this bridge, unfortunately, is another reason why change needs to happen. For now, reporting in Columbus, I'm 10TV's Richard Solomon.